heavily armed gunmen stormed a gas field in Algeria and claimed to have taken a group of 41 international workers hostage. In Norway, Christian Bakker, executive vice president for Statoil. The intruders took control over the area after a relatively short time. This is a big gas facility in the desert near the Libyan border. Libya. This man, Mokdar Belmokdar, an Islamist militant affiliated with al-Qaeda, is believed to have led the raid. Three people were reportedly killed. The kidnapped include Japanese, British, Norwegian, and French nationals, as well as seven Americans. The reaction from Washington. We condemn in strongest terms the terrorist attack on British petroleum personnel and facilities at the Inn Amenas, uh, Algeria, earlier today. The group responsible for the raid says it is in response to France's military involvement against Islamist militants in Mali. In Paris, President Francois Hollande. I am in constant contact with the Algerian authorities who are doing and will do what is needed. We are also in contact with the heads of state and government of the countries concerned. All this is not without a connection, as everyone will have understood, to the operation that we are undertaking. The kidnapping in southern Algeria is raising fears that French military action in Mali could prompt more Islamist revenge attacks on western targets.